Doug Williams with Viva Las Vegas Autos bringing you another badass vehicle. This is a 1937 five window Ford Coupe with a lot of money invested and it's an all steel, what they call all Henry steel uh, coupe, five window coupe. And this thing has had a lot of money spent in it and it looks beautiful. I mean, it's really an incredible vehicle. It's got a 302, 345 horsepower, uh, fuel injected motor in it um, with a C4 TCI Street Fighter transmission. It's got a Ford, it's all Ford, which is really cool. It's got a Ford 8 inch with a 325 posi gear, power steering, Mustang 2 disc brakes up front. It's uh, got an all aluminum exhaust all the way around, which is great. Um, it's a uh, air ride all the way around, which uh, makes it so this thing can come up a little bit in the air, which it needs, because uh, when it's dropped down, it looks cool. But uh, you rub a little bit of the tires when it's down like that. Um, 1,500 miles is all on this thing since the restoration. And uh, the guy put well over, he's got well over $50,000 just in receipts and over 2,700 hours of labor into this build on this car. Um, it's got uh, dual power seats in it, all leather interior, which is cool. It's got vintage air and heat in it. Um, it's got the I did it brushed aluminum steering column on it, banjo leather steering wheel on it as well, AM FM CD player, it's got the classic instruments, uh, speedo gauges and quad gauges, what they call quad gauges, and uh, it's just really nice, nice vehicle. This uh, the paint and finish on this car is in excellent condition, there's only a few minor blemishes on this car, very, very few. It's got these uh, Eagle rims on it, which looks like they're uh, alloy, Eagle alloys, real sharp looking, hand cook, uh, B12 Evo tires, front and rear. And being an all metal car, that's where this thing retains its value. This is the only damage that I could find on the car, where it must have cracked at some point in time, driving it too low. But uh, under the hood, this thing's gorgeous too. All show and all go at 345 horsepower and very well done. Hang on a second, I gotta get that down. There we go. Didn't realize that stay up. Also, this front window pops out which I thought was pretty cool and all the bright work on this thing is gorgeous too and uh, when you see the pictures of the undercarriage you'll agree there's some uh, serious money put into this car so we got the suspension up on the car with the air suspension which sits right behind the driver's seat it's pretty easy to get to we'll go for a ride in this thing They look good low, but they ride nice high. So let's go for a ride. Love the sound of this car. It's got a nice lope to the cam. A lot of work, a lot of money went into the engine. Suspension and everything like that, obviously. These old steel bodies are uh, pretty rare, and uh, when they're in this kind of condition, even more rare, uh, where they've been done right, built right. This car is built to be able to drive and enjoy with the air conditioning and everything like that. Um, the C4 transmission, TCI. That, that transmission just shifts smooth, rides nice. Actually, like I said, makes this car really enjoyable to drive. Never runs hot. Runs out quite nice actually. Power steering on it, of course. It's fantastic. She's got power.
miles an hour cruise on this thing is fine. Just an all-around fun car to drive. They take these old rides and make them modern. Just makes it so you can get in the car and go grab some groceries with it if you want. Go to the shows and enjoy it. It turns on a dime too, which is awesome. You know, when I put these things on auction, a lot of times uh, I get emails asking me what my bottom line is, what my lowest price I'm willing to take. I really hate that dumb question. Uh, so if you're listening to this video video and you've heard it, don't email me with that question. I'm fine with somebody getting on the phone with me and ask me what they are, you know, might be able to buy it for and, and talk to me about what they're willing to offer, but there's no sense jacking a jaw if I don't have a buyer. Um, so the whole point of the, uh, putting this car on auction is to find the people that are serious about buying and find out what they're willing to spend and what they're willing to offer. Never matters what I want. I could want a hundred grand. I could want two hundred grand. I could want twenty grand. Wouldn't matter. The only thing that matters is a willing buyer that's willing to open up their wallet and pay. So, give me a holler. That's the only way I'll talk to you about price is by talking to you on the phone. So call me at 702-353-7500, and I'll be happy to have a pleasant conversation with you about what you're willing to offer and what I'm willing to sell it for. And. Uh, that's, I stay in business because I end up doing that and I end up making great deals with my clients. So hope to hear from you soon. This is Doug Williams with Viva Las Vegas Autos bringing another way cool car. Talk to you next time.